They're off in the Franklin Stakes. Tony Ann quick into stride. So is Twilight Gleaming. BG Warrior there up on the far outside. Twilight Gleaming, BG Warrior. They come to the front together. Caravel is moving up the rail into third here early on as they head for the far turn. Tony Ann alongside her in fourth. Base Storm over to the rail in the fifth position. Linguistic is sixth up on the outside. Trained to Artemis is in seventh. Wakanaka is last of the eight as they head on to the far turn. Back up front, Twilight Gleaming to the inside and BG Warrior there to the outside. The opening quarter in 21.09 seconds. Gap of five lengths back to Caravel, who's third by three. Base Storm is in fourth. Tony Ann is fifth. BG Warrior, Twilight Gleaming going at it for the lead. Here's Caravel. Here's Tony Ann on her outside. Twilight Gleaming, Caravel, Tony Ann, trained to Artemis, running late down the center of the course. Here's Tony Ann challenging Twilight Gleaming. Caravel is there. And train to Artema still fourth. Tony Ann trying to get ahead in front from Caravel. Tony Ann wins the Franklin Stakes for Flavian Pratt. The official winner of Keeneland's featured seventh race, 27th running of the Franklin Stakes Grade 2, number 8, Tony Ann. Owned by Anthony Fantacola and A. Veneri Racing Incorporated of Alex Veneri, trained by Phil D'Amato, jockey Flavian Pratt. Tony Ann, a five-year-old daughter of Cairo Prince, out of Never Ever by NXS, bred in Kentucky by Alex Veneri Racing, LLC. Five and a half furlongs over the turf listed good. One minute, 2.42 seconds. Now the trophy presentation for the featured Franklin Stakes, Lexington Mayor Linda Gorton presents to the connections of Tony Ann. Tony Ann finishing strong today in the Franklin Stakes. The featured race on this Sunday, Flavian Pratt joins me aboard Tony Ann. This filly showed some brilliance here. As the things were setting up in front of you, did you have a sense that they were going quick? I mean, I, I would imagine that you would have expected the pace to be quick with this level of competition. Yeah, it felt like the pace was, uh, was strong enough, and I, I was traveling really well behind uh, Caravel, so I was pleased with my trip, and uh, when I tip her out, she uh, responded really well. Um, a bit worried by the 16 pole because obviously Caravel came back on us, but she was really game. How much did you have to push to get past Caravel and to keep that advantage that you had? Well, to, to, to uh, go by Caravel, you got to go all out. <laughs> but no, she, she was really game today. Well done, Flavian. Thank you. Tony Ann, very good today in the grade two feature, the Franklin Stakes.